after our police well or are there issues about housing education for policemen which the normal citizen doesn't look at when they're just doing a blame game with the police all the time there definitely are issues with the uh, with the housing of the policemen they are they live in a very uh, abysmal housing conditions the actual number of uh, funds that are required to give the satisfaction level which the government desires to give to the policemen is a very huge number. Now the government has allowed the housing corporation to borrow funds from the market to build houses. Recently the government has also allowed the FSI of four for building uh, uh, police housing. I think these measures will alleviate uh, the problem to an extent. Along with that we are trying uh, the, to persuade the government to provide houses to uh, cooperative housing societies of policemen themselves so that when they retire they can have a decent uh, roof over their head that's the ultimate requirement and the issue of education when the children when they're being transferred every two or three years well we are uh, pushing for building hostels in the major cities where the children need to pursue their uh, studies some of our cities already have this provision of hostels. We are taking up uh, construction of hostels from our own welfare funds. We are also engaging in uh, career guidance systems for our children. It's a fact that because of the transfers of the parents and uh, the fact that the father is away from the house for majority of the day, parental guidance is not available to the children as much as it should be. And therefore we need to step in. Yeah, yeah, yeah.